the human body is very powerful and you think the penis should be left out no the penis is not left out good day everyone and welcome back to nurses lecture room youtube channel my name is miss mary popularly known as the nurse with a difference and i make learning easy and accessible for all my viewers today i'm going to be sharing with you 12 facts about erection if you have a man and you've ever had erection this video is for you and also if you are a man you are finding it difficult to keep erection this video is for you if you are a woman and you have a man in your life that's having erection this video is for you but before we go into details in today's class if you are new on our youtube channel and these are content you are interested in please click on that subscribe button turn on that notification bell so you don't miss out for all my returning subscribers this is no smith mary saying thank you let's go there all right welcome back like i earlier said today i'm going to be sharing with you 12 facts about erection i'm going to be going straight into the point i don't want to waste your time the first one i have to share with you is that babies can be born with erection yes babies can be born with erection let me go further 50 fetuses were studied i mean 50 babies growing in the womb that's fetus they were studied and guess what they found so these fetuses they were between the gestation period was between 36 to 39 weeks of gestation that's the woman was between 36 to 39 weeks pregnant that was when they did this study so when during this study they did an ultrasound for these fetuses when they did an ultrasound they measured the penal length and guess what they found out of these 50 babies that were studied 12 of them 22 percent of time they had erection and to crown it all this erection lasted for 5 to 17 minutes you can see it's not just full grown-up men that have erection even fetuses inside the womb of a woman had erection the cause of this whole erection in a mother's womb is not really understood but it's just believed that it's part of the nervous system and the whole growth processes and changes taking place in a male fetus so you can see erection don't only occur in grown-ups but it started when they were little inside their mother's womb and i also want to let you know that even the female fetuses had their own peculiar erection then that takes us to the second point i would like to share with you the second thing the second fact i have to share with you is that the penis is not a muzzle yes for those that feel the penis is a muzzle that they can actually train the penis like you know when you build your muzzle yeah bodybuilding you build your muscles the penis cannot be built like that because the penis is not a muzzle then you may want to ask what it is then i'm going to tell you the penis is actually a cylindrical tissue that is made up of corpus pongiosum and corpus cabenosum. Yes, these are the tissues that made that makes up the penis in such a way that during erections, these tissues are filled with blood. That is why it is standing. They are filled with blood. So for those that have the mindset that the penis is actually a muzzle, I'm here to tell you that it is not a muzzle, or rather it is a cylindrical tissue made up of what corpus spongiosum and corpus cabenosum. What point I have to share with you is men have erection even while they are asleep. So for those that feel that it's only when the men are awake, when they are fully awake, when they see a lady, that is when erection occur. I just want to tell you that erection occur in all ages, like all ages in men while they are asleep. This is known as nocturnal penai to me sense, also called money wood. I want to let you know that it is completely normal and an average man have three to five erection during the night. Hope you get it. So it's not when you're awake, that is when erection takes place. Then that takes us to the other points which I want to share with you. The fourth point I have to share with you is shoe size and height are not a reliable predictor of the size of the penis during erection shoe size and height are not a reliable predictor 
of the size of the penis during erection for those that have the mindset that when you see a short man it simply means that the erection is going to be very very small and when you see a tall man it simply means that the erection or their penis is going to be on a larger size i just want to let you know that that is not a reliable predictor or a reliable detector of the size of the penis then that takes me to the fifth point which is we have the growers and we have the showers kind of penis i'm going to be explaining the difference between the two types the difference between the growers and the showers for the growers what it simply means is that when the penis is erect it can increase as high as 56 percent like more than half it can increase as high as 56 percent when the penis is erect the size increase when it goes from the flaccid state to the erect space that is why it is known as the growers why for the showers during erection you might not notice any difference like the difference is usually very very minute when compared to the flaccid and the erect so for those that have um, the growers it actually increases a lot when they are erect so that is the two types of penis then that takes me to the sixth point which i want to share with you and that is the penis can break yes the penis can break it is not the kind of break we see when we come talk about um the bones but yes it can break i made a full video on penile fracture if you've not watched it i'm going to be leaving the link in the description box below so you have access about penile fracture know the causes what is likely to cause this and what you need to do but in all Penile fracture is an emergency that needs to be tackled immediately. When it happens, you hear a pop sound, there is a sound, there is severe pain, and you have to see the doctor as soon as possible to get it sorted out. It's not something you should be shy about. A penile fracture does not occur in a flaccid penis. It occurs when the penis is fully erect. That is when fracture of the penis occurs. The seventh point I want to share with you is that erections used to have spines like spines in animals not in men so it is found that the difference between the erection in animals and that of men that is the spine and that is as a result of a particular genetic code there's a genetic code in animals that is not in men that is why men's erection does not have spine there's a lot of research about it why it is it is just like that but i'm not going to be going into detail i want to let you know that men gave up that genetic code for a bigger brain so they don't have it that is why men have the kind of brain they have so if they had that genetic code they might not have a bigger brain they might not be able to think like they could think as at now so that is the difference between that of an animal and that that we that which is found in the male counterpart so that, that takes me to the other point so the eighth point i'm going to be sharing with you is that you can have orgasm without erection there's a difference between orgasm and erection so if you are having erectile dysfunction you are a man battling with erectile dysfunction you can also fully get to orgasm without an erected penis yes so if you don't know now you know then this other point i want to share with you which is the ninth point it's kind of somehow to me is in regards to kellogg conflicts do you know that the man that created this Kellogg conflicts actually created it with the mindset of stopping masturbation yes because he is the kind of man that believes that um, sex is just for production it's for something that's not just the way we are thinking it so he created color conflicts to help distract our mind from that from masturbation but today will you as an individual say it is working or it is not working then the 10th point i have to share with you is guess smoking can make your penis shrink yeah if you're a man and you're thinking why is my penis getting smaller why is it shrinking why am i experiencing this shrinkage um in this penis and you're smoking that can be the cause of that penis shrinkage because smoking can make the penis shrink then generally smoking drinking is not good for your general health it's not good for your general body if you meet a cardiologist most times you ask them what they would like to do in their lifetime they will tell you smoking because smoking is not good for the heart it's not good for a lot of things so smoking can make your penis shrink if you are a man you've not had any reason you to see why you should quit smoking i think because of your penis that should give you a clue why you should quit smoking the 11th point i want to share with you is 
half of your erection takes place inside your body. Yes. The one you are seeing on the outside is just little. Half of what's like half of the whole erection, half of it takes place inside the body and it's just little you can see on the outside. Then the twelfth point I want to share with you is you can have erection before you die, and that is death erection. So if you see a dead man and this dead man had erection, so don't be surprised. That is called death erection, and it is quite normal and it's it's okay. All right, don't be surprised and say, Oh, he had erection. Doesn't mean this man has been having sex all through his life, he's dead and he's thinking thinking about the uh, sex. It is normal. There's something called death erection. So these are the 12 facts I have to share with you today in regards to erection. If you have any question, you can drop in the comment section and definitely I'll try to answer as much as I can. So thank you very much for staying tuned. Thank you very much for watching this particular video. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe and also don't forget to share with a friend if you got value. For all my returning subscribers, this is Nosmes Mary saying thank you. Bye and see you in our next video.